we were saying, I kind of towards the beginning, anime is not necessarily a sustainable space to live in. Anime, if you're thinking that anime is going to pay your bills and help you live and, and grow in the way that you'd like to in a, in a sustaining and flourishing way, very likely not so much, especially as the, with the climate as it is right now. For most people, most of us have to diversify somehow, be it like that other, there was a question before about the conventions, be it teaching, writing, directing, any other avenue of just work in general lots of us wear lots of different hats mm -hmm. at any one given time and a lot of the people who filled the... out this survey are, are in fact mm -hmm. that applies yeah. to as well so yeah and a, and a large portion of of uh of voice actors in general or, or dubbing actors in general don't remain dubbing actors for their entire careers a lot of us will move on into um more interactive stuff they'll move on into more commercial stuff uh and western animation mm -hmm. or they'll start directing primarily or they'll become producers like there this is still a journey usually anime is not the end game it is for some folks perhaps but not everybody and not most of us so while that's always growing and changing and people are growing and changing and, and entering the, the the landscape and leaving it at the same time, there's a continuous flow. Yeah. So there's going to be new folks. There's going to be new faces. There's going to be new voices. It's just, it's just reality. Yeah. You know, and thinking that we need to keep anybody out or, or stop a whole region from working to, yeah, to save our I own don't... hides is, completely counterintuitive and counterproductive 